What are the side effects of estradiol? Let's talk about it. Anytime you take exogenous hormones, meaning not what your body naturally makes, but hormones you take, you may experience some side effects. And that's true of all hormones. Even your own endogenous estradiol, which is that which your body naturally makes, can cause side effects, especially if it's out of balance with your progesterone. Remember, estrogen is the fertilizer growing lush, healthy tissues, and progesterone is the gardener turning off estrogen's unwanted growth. Too much estradiol can cause dark spots on your face called melasma. Estrogen stimulates melanin production, which gives color to your skin. Melasma is a common side effect of birth control pills and can incur pregnancy because of the naturally occurring high estrogen levels. Stopping estrogen will help reduce further darkening of your skin, but it'll take a couple of months to lighten and you may need to use a topical lightening agent to further reduce the dark splotches caused by too much estradiol. Now, while estrogen helps keep your cells and tissues very well hydrated, too much estradiol can cause water retention, which makes you feel uncomfortably bloated. Prior to your period, some women will experience five to 10 pounds of water weight gain. And if you retain water in your youth, you may be sensitive to hormone replacement therapy during menopause. Lowering estradiol dose can help, and natural diuretics like Uva Ursi also can help reduce the water retention and too much estradiol can cause breast pain and swelling. Normally, estrogen surges to stimulate breast tissue to prepare for pregnancy and lactation. If you're taking too much estradiol, it can aggravate pre-existing fibrocystic breast condition and enlarge existing cysts. Reducing estradiol can help, and so can DIM. It's a supplement derived from cruciferous vegetables that can help your body metabolize estrogen into the less inflammatory forms. Now, too much estradiol can also increase uterine bleeding. It can stimulate uterine fibroid growth, which contributes to heavy periods. What's most effective is to be sure you're taking an adequate amount of progesterone to counterbalance the estrogen. And while estrogen stimulates your brain, helping you to be creative and learn and remember, too much can contribute to anxiety. And if you're not taking enough progesterone to make calming GABA, Estrogen can overstimulate you. The most dangerous side effect of taking too much estradiol is blood clots. Oral estradiol can increase the risk of blood clots. In fact, taking any steroid hormone by mouth, estrogen, testosterone, DHA, or cortisol, can increase your risk of blood clots. And that's because oral steroid hormones interfere with your liver's clotting cascade. And dangerous blood clots in your legs, called venous thrombosis, can break off and get into your lungs, causing a life-threatening pulmonary embolism, or in your coronary arteries, causing a heart attack, or even in your brain, causing a stroke. Estrogen side effects are something we talk a lot about in our hormone support group, which is free. You can join by signing up for our hormone reboot training. If you have a family history of blood clots, and especially if you've ever had a blood clot, then you are not a candidate for oral estrogen therapy, especially in birth control pills. Talk to your healthcare provider to see if you might use estrogen transdermally through the skin or intravaginally. I'll see you in the next video.